Alright then, so hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy VI Blindfolded LLG. So, uh, in this mini-sode first off, I'll be doing the okay part of this segment, which is going to be just putting Vanish on my characters real quick. I want it on all three characters, so it'll require a little bit of luck, but it's no big deal, compared, especially not compared to what's coming. I really just had to switch this controller slot so that Draga was on his own controller slot, because he's the one who's summoning Phantom here. Although I could probably give it to Gao for better results in hindsight, but whatever, I don't care to deal with it right now. It's not a huge detail. So yeah, let's just shove the blindfold up for a second. Alright, so just about anybody who's uh, ever prepared for or looked at LLGs in this game probably knows what's coming now, and that is ninja dodging. Uh, if... Oops, no, that was Drago. Derp. So basically I have to run through the entire floating continent without uh, getting attacked by ninjas once which is just a whole boatload of luck, so you can guess how much fun that's going to be to do blindfolded. This battle is not ninjas, thankfully enough, but I'll just have to keep trucking it out, I suppose, until I, uh, I, or and by get it right, I mean get it lucky. I got pretty decently lucky there most of the time I hit Gao. Alright, so that's it for the first and easy part of it. Let's save, quickly save state, and Gotta hope that streaky FS6 RNG kicks in and sails me away to victory here. So, is this it? Is this the run where I make it past the second fight again? The good thing is how the back guard and uh, the Gale hairpin make the non-ninja random encounters a lot easier to escape from, otherwise they'd be pretty, fairly threatening, to be honest. 
two, three. Count had steps more often than usual here, but that's to make sure that I fight as few battles as possible. I need every little bit I can get. In some ways that's a good thing, because it tells me I'm going the right direction. Okay, in all ways it's a good thing, because it wasn't ninjas. Let's see if I'll make it back all the way to stage 4 without getting another one. Random encounter, that is. on the next step. It's not a good place for the random encounter. But it's not ninjas, so I don't really care that much. last battle before I make it to stage four. Oh, life shaver. Despite the fact that that removes my banish, it's good enough sign for what it is. And I am actually not going to complain. Uh, they're unlikely to down me with life shaver alone, with life shaver shenanigans not enough of those guys in one fight using their life shaver usually to actually off me all the way. set to take to get to the staircase. Okay. There's enough enemies here that I know there's not ninjas. Oh, there's still someone around. Get out of there, slowpoke. One more. Alright, I'm starting to make it close enough to at least have some hope here. Might just be throwing some hope in my face just to yank it away at the last second again, but... 
I've almost passed my record of how far I've gotten. I've got at the very uh, most one battle left before I get there. I mean, not the end to my record. I've got likely three battles before I get to the end. Right. Up. Alright. I hit the wall here, so I passed my record. But I'm due for a battle any moment now, so it might be short-lived. Nope. Probably a preemptive strike, too. Though the regular enemies have taken somewhat of a backseat. I think they have one or two battles left. Hopefully no more than that. One, two, three, four. Up the staircase. All the way right to here. Then all the way to the top. I don't like taking an extra step again so close to the end. But I feel it's justified in this case. I tried to work out other alternate ways of going about this and they all sucked. Actually, I guess it's two steps. So I go one in and one out, but whatever. Alright, now I'm going long enough without a battle that I'm actually starting to get worried that I'm messing this up. Don't be ninjas, don't be ninjas. Okay, it's not ninjas. Alright, all the way to the right first so that I don't forget where I am. There's only room for one battle, realistically. Gao yeah, was the one who apparently was unlucky enough to... Alright. All the way to the top here. I'm surprised Gao got life shavered. It's almost always Strago. For obvious reasons. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, so if nothing went wrong, and nothing happened, no encounters come, I just gotta walk straight down. Please work. Yes! Okay, I made it. Phew, that actually went better than I thought it might. It only took, I think, five attempts, and two of them ended before I even reached part two. Which is actually pretty decent, because then I don't have to go through the whole thing again. Alright, so let's save that here. Don't want to lose that progress. See you next time. Up one. Around that spot. All the way to the right. Probably got the two characters after this one. Uh oh. I'm not escaping. No, it's ninjas. The worst part is I don't even have a really way to get past the wiry drag. I mean, kill the ninjas and run away from the wiry dragon. Which is a possibility in, the, in a regular game. Even in LLG, there's a chance of being able to kill ninjas before you die and then escape from the wire dragon, but in the blindfolded run, there's no chance of that.